Hi, my name is Dimitri and I'm a Senior Technical Marketing Engineer at Palo Alto Networks. In this video, I'm going to demonstrate the ServiceNow integration CloudBlade. The ServiceNow CloudBlade allows for real-time ingestion of Prisma SD WAN events into the ServiceNow Incident Management Platform. This enables NOC and IT teams to immediately take action to troubleshoot and resolve a network incident, managing end-user impact and maintaining network estimates. Before I dive into the integration details, it is important to understand the Prisma sd event framework. Within any network, incidents can and will occur that may or may not be a cause for concern. To that end, Prisma sd implements alarms and alerts within its system. An alarm is an indication of a fault in the system that can be raised and cleared, and their impact is gauged by its severity. An alert may or may not be indicative of a fault in the system, but should still be investigated. Before we start configuring the ServiceNow CloudBlade, we need to make sure the incident table is created on ServiceNow. The CloudBlade will need a user with roles Web Service Admin and REST API Explorer to access this incident table using REST APIs. We are now ready to review the ServiceNow CloudBlade integration. The ServiceNow CloudBlade can be found under the CloudBlades tab. Click on Configure to set up the integration. Choose the latest version and make sure the admin status is set to enabled prior to installation. Enter the default URL derived from the table name as described in the prerequisites. Enter the credentials for the user created for the CloudBlade. The poll interval determines how often the CloudBlade queries the SD-WAN controller for the subscribed events. Subscribe for events by clicking on the checkbox. You can avoid information overload and significantly reduce the number of incident tickets created on ServiceNow by subscribing to summary events. For instance, a flapping link generating a high volume of alarms that would have otherwise inundated the incident table with tickets can now be summarized into a single flap rate exceeded event. For each Prisma sd -WAN event attribute included in the incident table schema, Enter the corresponding column name. For this demo, our table schema incorporates all of the incident details. There are also options to configure custom field values. Click Save and install the CloudBlade. Once you save the config, the CloudBlade will create incident records for all subscribed events currently present on the system or as they occur in the future. If an alarm condition is clear, the CloudBlade updates the existing incident record by setting the clear to true and the incident state to resolve. NOC admins can track this column to make sure they invest time only on unresolved issues. In addition to resolution, updates made to other event properties are also propagated to the incident record. For instance, an ongoing maintenance has caused the proved Hacienda site connectivity to be degraded. Let's update the notes to reflect that. This change in event will be propagated to the incident record. Here we can see, by subscribing to summary alarm, NOC admins can also get visibility into all the related alarms that contributed to the site degradation. For more details on the integration and other supportive features, please review the integration guide posted on docs.paloaldonetworks.com.